Knife. Clip. Key. Gun. Knife. Clip. Key. Gun. Garrels. Bows. Smokes. Nuns. Garrels. Oh, I mean, feck. <laughs> Key. Gun. Knife. Feck. Drank. Nuns. Garrels. Alright, that should be that should be good. That should be fine. I would put my cursor over my fine meter, but I can't. Alright, let's just do a little more. It's gonna be weird getting used to this again. Hoi! 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 <laughs> uh, okay, I think that's good. Um, I should probably go back into the last room, shouldn't I? What could be behind these oak panel doors? What about you, Jimmy? You an oak man? Oak is nice. <laughs> anyway, these controls. Oh, I'm never going to get used to them. Anyway, hello guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil, and as you can see, I am exactly where we left off. Exactly where we left off. Exactly as I do. Uh, la from last time, when that horrible, horrible post-commentary, I'm so... I am so sorry, everybody, to have defiled your ears so with such horrendous, horrendous commentary. I should have no I sh can do better. But we did push that statue off of the ledge which means we can get the blue gem so let's go do that right now because if we i can't remember what we've done i know rebecca's missing again damn her that silly little girl I'm trying to get in the way of a man doing a man's job <laughs> oh it's funny, too, because I just finished reading The Stepford Wives for uh, Frankenstein class. A literary theory, that's what it's called. And what we actually had to do for that. Did I introduce who I am, by the way? Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play, Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with Miox Fu. Uh, whoa, whoa. 540, okay. Again, I did not check my time. This time I caught it, though. Will you take the blue jewel? I will indeed, sir. Why, thank you very much. I will take this from your shattered innards, Mr. Statue. And we will go put that in... Not in there. We've already opened that. Go, go around. I'm going to go put that in the... Uh, in the... Uh, the face thing. Because, you know, jewels, and you got a face with sockets in it. Where else do you think you're going to go? Or they're going to go, <laughs> even. <laughs> um, but no, for the Literary Theory class, I had to write an adaptation for a film adaptation, a, fi a script, as though I was writing the introduction to... Um, it reads, Some tigers have a red eye and a blue eye. Indeed, and I have a blue eye. Whoa, I was not expecting you to move already. That is some crazy business right there. What the heck is this? Will you take the Windcrest? I will indeed. Is this going to be like the guy from, uh, from, uh, Inuyasha, and now I'll be able to suck? <laughs> no, I already sucked. No, uh, will I be able to s just suck infinite things through my hand with that? Um, or is it going to be like Jackie Chan and now I've got the... I've got the wind talisman! <laughs> One more thing. Wind talisman, very dangerous. Can I look at that painting? But anyway, I had to do an introduction as though it was the... Or an adaptation as though it was the introduction to a film. No, I can't. Oh well. I think this just leads to the greenhouse, doesn't it? 
pretty sure. And we've got... Well, we've got everything but the health. The plants that I left there for probably a good reason. So I'm just gonna leave that where it is. Um... So nice to not have to deal with the zombies anymore. Did we check this room? I'm pretty sure we did. I don't know. I'm, I'm just I'm just stalling now because I do not want to go to where I know I have to go. See, you'd think there would be something else in this room besides just like shotgun shells or something. Well, there was the shotgun, wasn't there? Can I open any of the bottom drawers? No. Okay. The mangled up shotgun. And what I ended up doing was actually, um, well, for those of you who haven't seen the book, you've probably, or read the book, you've probably seen one of the movies, either the 1975 one or the 2004 crazy as balls one. <laughs> um, so I don't think I'm going to be spoiling anything. Well, there's nothing to spoil. In it's It's pretty much obvious halfway through the movie what's going on and movies what's going on it's pretty much obvious halfway through the book that there's a few things that could be going on and we need a keypad or key code for that and i'm not spoiling anything so but i still don't want to say anything about it anyway i had to make an introduction and what i decided to do was try to paint the husbands in a more Not complacent, not not passive. Uh, I paint. I tried to paint them in a better light so that a person could relate to them more. Well, not relate, but pity them more. Um, because there are some parts where jo in the book where Joanna goes absolutely batshit insane. I'm just getting that out there. I mean, I understand what's going on, but when she just goes out into the middle of the street cackling loudly like a mad woman. Something's going on. <laughs> well, something is, of course, going on, but... Alright, what have we visited? We are right there by the top right of the red thing. We can visit all these... Oh, no, we haven't. No, we haven't. We've got two places, once again, where we can go. We can go either... This way? Or we could go to the ground floor. We could deal with the doggies. Or we could deal with the attic and for once I'm gonna go with the attic I tried to set paint them in a sympathetic light that's what it is um because there are points when they the when Joanna's just that shit insane but I mean it's an adaptation so I can do whatever I want with it it's not it doesn't have to stay true to the story and I wanted to do something fun with it so I thought what is the most radically different thing I could do with this. And it, it hit me. Like a truck filled with bricks. You have used the shield key. Oh, crap. Oh. This key is useless now. Discard. No. Don't ever discard anything in these games. By the way, some of you might be wondering why I, like, I've, I've been getting people being like, Oh my god, you got through that really quick! How do you do that? Have any of you heard of a game called Beneath the Steel Sky? No? It's a point-and-click adventure, and it's pretty damn hard. Like, 20 minutes to do a simple thing hard. There is no music. I do not like this. Um, look it up. You can get it for free. And it's, it's really good. It's really hard, but it's really good. Books and gadgetry, nothing useful. Go, go, and s go, go, gadget, bookshelf. Oh god, oh god, what the heck is that? That is a giant freaking snake. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Uh, no, 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 no. Get out. Oh my god, I know. No, 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 no. Screw that. Screw that. Oh my god, I would rather deal with dogs any day. Poison, poison, poison. Didn't we have... 
botany book. What were you? That was file two. Wasn't there a way to cure poison? About medicinal herbs. As you may know, there are very many plants that have medical effects since ancient times. Blue one natural neutralizes natural toxins. Oh crap. Uh, we haven't seen any blue herbs. Okay, um. So now we have to decide what we're gonna do. Oh, great. Oh, hey. Oh, cool. It's all organized and everything. That's pretty cool. But now we have to decide what we're gonna do because there's two ways we can go. We can either risk it with the snake or risk it with the dogs. The snake only poisoned me. I'm going with the snake. I'm going back in. I'm going. I'm going in. Oh my god! No, I, I. Snakes! It had to be snakes. Oh, why did it have to be snakes? No, no, no. Oh, come on, get up. Okay, you know what? F screw this, I'm running past. Go, 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 go. What is that? What is that? Get it. Will you take the moon crest? Sure, why not? Get out of there, Chris. Go. Chris, you're gonna die. No! Oh. Well, we died. Shoot! I don't have any, a save state that... Or, uh, I don't have a save game that early on, either. Uh, well, how are we doing? We were, like, ten minutes in. Um, see, it's been a while since I've played, so I'll meet you guys when I think we're at where we need to be or something. Oh, snakes. Why does it have to be snakes? Oh, shoot. 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 I think we want this one. You have once again entered the world of survival horror. Good luck. <laughs> oh, what do we have? Oh, thank God. Okay, I think this is the right one. Yes, ink ribbon. Oh, with this is the right one. Okay, I'll meet you guys in a little while. I don't know how long it'll take for me to get back where I need to be. But I'll see you guys then. Cool. Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping into the future. Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping into the future. I wanna fly like an eagle to the sea. Fly like an eagle, let my spirit carry me. I want to fly like an eagle. Can it be? Oh, there's a solution. Tick tock, do 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 do. Tick tock, tick. Tick tock, do 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 do. Get around the fucking rudder, Chris! <laughs> Where are we? Uh, wait a minute. Go back. G I A. G-I-A-N-T-E-G-G -G. 
G I A N T E G G. Richard. La 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 Oh, no wonder there were handprints. Oh, well, at least I know that I only need to use that key once. Ha! Ah. Tick tock, do 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 do. Tick tock, tick. Tick tock, do 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 do. Tick tock, tick. Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping into the future yes i will this time any more goodies you got inside of you time keeps on i don't know why i've got that song stuck in my head everybody get up you're gonna jam now get ready for the space jam come on <laughs> probably because of that uh, just collecting that Weapons. I almost said enemies. I wish I knew how what that is for. Jeez. La 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 I'm a man, you can tell by my well chiseled face. Redfield. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't heard Rock Piper Mario do that voice in forever. Poor me, not getting to hear. Poor Boggy. Da 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 Step lively, my son. For it will be the last step you ever take. <laughs> okay, you know what? We're doing this now. Check. Oh, look, there's an armor on it. Alright, armor key. Now for the gold one. Check. Oh look, there's a sword on it. Sword key. And I want to check the shotgun quick too. It's too dangerous to fire. Does it have another use? Wait, what? Does it have another use? The only thing I can think of is, is a, like, a blunt weapon. Hmm. I'm gonna carry... Like, the only thing I can think of is if it was used to, like, break a lock or something. Yeah, tap your foot and scratch your chin, Chris, because that's what I'm doing right now. It's actually pretty accurate. Actually, not at all. I'm not doing it because my hands are on the controller. I'll leave it in there for now. Besides, we need the two open spaces. But let's see, we've seen the wind crest and the moon crest. Does that mean there's gonna be uh, another crest? I don't know. <laughs> like, all I can think of is that kid from Inuyasha and now Sailor Moon. So that's, like, I'm trying to think is there going to be, like, I don't know, Firecrest from Avatar The Last Airbender? Rawr! No. 
No, I, I want to see like a snake crest and be like, oh my god, the snake talisman, we can turn invisible. <laughs> and then puff on my inhaler. <laughs> oh my god, that show is amazing. It is, though. I love Jackie Chan Adventures. It's just good. Good, clean fun. With kung fu action. Hey -yo! Oh, wait, no, we, we gotta go downstairs. We need to get the crest. We need to swap it with the other crest. Yeah, remember, how, guys, how I was saying, like, you know how I'm so good at this? Beneath the steel sky. Because those kinds of puzzles where you have to per make sure you have something to replace what you're taking, that's that kind of, those, that's where the, that comes from, I'm pretty sure. Plus, it's just common sense. I mean, if you've ever seen Indiana Jones, how are you not going to think that? I really wonder what's happened to Jill and Wesker. I mean, I've been all over this mansion except for behind those dogs. And we still have not seen hide nor hair of them, especially hair. I hope we don't find hide of them. That would be pretty gross. Take the wooden emblem. Yes, I will. Okie dokie, Loki. And we're going to go over here. And we're going to go back to Rebecca. And I'm going to make fun of her some more. Because she's such a ditzy... Dits, dits, girl, dits, 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 girl, dits, dits, dits. <laughs> Go in. Why, hello, Rebecca. How are you doing? It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while. Okay, you're not going to talk to me jerk. I'm just gonna stand there, gaping mouth, dumbfounded that, oh my god, there's a secret wall! Well, I did freak out when that happened too, but... Oh my god, we're gonna die! Well, you can't die in here, because if you, if you screwed that up, you just put the emblem back. It's not that hard. There we go. Now we're gonna go out and she's gonna be like, oh my god, Chris, are you okay? I'm gonna be like, chill, baby. I'm good. Chris, are you alright? It's all good, baby. <laughs> uh, I can't do a Johnny Bravo impression for the life of me. Come on, do the monkey with me. <laughs> uh, I love that show. I miss it. I never got to watch it as a kid, but the few episodes that I get to watch were hilarious. Like the episode where Johnny gets put in prison, but he accidentally gets put in the women's prison. <laughs> oh, that was a good episode. Speaking of other misogynistic things I like. <laughs> well, no, because Stepford Wives isn't misogynistic. It's pretty much the opposite. It's the hollow that an emblem was in. Oh yeah, we gotta go to our menu and use use. And someone pointed this out. That, you know, people are dying all around. Who would have the time and effort to put in a mechanism to hide a key behind a clock like this? And it's like, yeah, really? <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't remember your name. I believe you were new when you posted that comment. So... I must apologize, but thank you for pointing it out, because it was it was quite poignant. A carving of a shield. We know where that goes. <laughs> well, in the shield lock, of course. What, do you think I was insinuating something dirty? Okay. So, I think once I get the blue gem and get the crest from that, I think we're going to do another save. Just because I can? No, just because, um... Era. Just because... I don't want to lose everything. Actually, you know what? 
I think it's about time I let you all go. But before I do, I want to make an announcement. Because I have been, because I have put Golden Sun on hiatus for a while, and I just feel terrible about that because I love Golden Sun. I really do. Uh, ha! we get to fight a zombie, at least one zombie in the, this, this episode. Wow, you're a tenacious bugger, aren't you? All right, but well, let's let's kill him first. Run, stab. Great, 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 great. Well, what a waste of a stab. Not like it does that much anyway. You dead? Yeah, you're dead. Just in case, though. Anyway, like I was saying, because I have put Golden Sun on hold for a while, uh, it's not that I'm growing bored. Well, I am growing a little bored. Um, but that's because we went through Mobile Forest and stuff. And I told you guys how much I hate that place. I just need to take a little breather, get back on track with it, and I just gotta wait for myself to want to play the game again. So don't worry, we're gonna I'm gonna be going back to the game. It's just gonna take a little while. Uh, as far as this game goes, though, is I think it's gonna actually take Golden Sun's place for a while. Because uh, one of the things I didn't actually like about uh, about my episodes of Golden Sun is they're over way too quickly. Uh, I feel like I'm just jumping in and jumping right out. So what I might be doing is and this is a maybe and if it is going to happen in the future you know i never checked back here <gasps> oh my god there's a space back here i've been meaning to check that since like the first time i noticed it like f seven episodes ago or something like that <laughs> we'll check that out next episode though but what i might end up doing is i don't want to end up i don't want to upload like 30 minute episodes because Everybody's uploading 30 minute episodes right now. Hedonia, Rock Paper Mario, Pyro Dragon. And that's a lot of footage to watch over a weekend, especially when I've got to do stuff during the weekend. Uh, wrong door, Chris. So I'm, I'm still gonna like keep it around like 15 to 20 minutes. I'll probably make it 20 minutes just because that feels rounder for that kind of game. But this game, if I can swing it, we'll be taking the weekday place of Golden Sun. And I'll just be alternating Golden Sun, or the, I'll be alternating Resident Evil and... I didn't pick up the gem. God damn it. And I'll be, resi I'll rota I'll be alternating Resident Evil and Half-Life. Because honestly, I'm having a lot of fun with this game, and I had to put this down for like a couple weeks because I just didn't have the time to record. I've had two, three, I want to say like four projects that I've had to do over the last two weeks. Um, was it four? No, it might have been just three, but there, I've just had a lot of work to do over the last couple weeks. So, and with PAX East and Anime Boston happening at the same time, I've been completely swamped. I just haven't had the time to Let's Play as I wanted. I mean, I, I recorded like 10 episodes of Half-Life earlier this week because I didn't know when I would have the time to record. And I had a spare Tuesday. <laughs> so I just sat down and I'm like, I'm like you know what? I want to play Half-Life. I don't care that I have Golden Sun to record. I want to play Half-Life. So I played Half-Life. Same with this. I want to I want to play Resident Evil and I went through the wrong door again. I'm going to leave you guys off once I get the wind crest is what I'm saying. <laughs> Rebecca, you got some splaining to do, but you're gone. You're gone. Oh, goodness. Goodness little whistle when I make my S's that really annoys me when I listen to my voice and when I play it back then I'm like um but what I'm driving at is I'm just gonna change up the schedule and right now I'm just wasting time because I want to get that wind crest 
before I let you guys go. No, you must stay here until I get the wind crest. There we go. Because it's like the one thing we did do in this episode. Aha! Uh -huh. Take it. Take it. There we go. Will you take the wind crest? Nah, of course I will. Rawr. Rawr. <laughs> The wonderful thing about tiggers are tiggers are wonderful things. Their tops are made out of rubber. Their bottoms are made out of springs. They're pouncy, pouncy, trouncy, trouncy, fun, 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 fun. Unless they're made of cement. And then in that case, they're drop and shatter. <laughs> but the most wonderful thing about tiggers is that he's not the only one. All right, enough of that. So I'll see you guys next time on Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with Mioix Fu. And next time... We are going to be doing two things. We're going to be checking out that little nook behind the stairs, which I cannot believe that I missed out on. And we will, maybe, if that doesn't prove very fruitful, we will be taking on some dagues. Uh, well, we know this is a single-use key, so I'm going to switch it with the sword key, I think. So I don't want to end up ha being at the end of the hall with those dogs and be like, oh crap, this door is locked. What the hell? So I'm going to do that. Anything else we have in our inventory? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. Oh, that's right. I want to save. And there is a typewriter right here. Okay. So I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play, Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with Miox Fu, even though I said that already. And... And... I'm not leaving till I save. All right, so we saved in five last, so I'm going to save in one this time. Alright. Oh! There we go, six. So I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Resident Evil Blind with Mioix Fu, and that's the third time I said it. Take it easy. <laughs>